Hey guys, nice you. Welcome back to new magic module episode. In this series, I show you new magic modules each week. Now, if you don't have magic installed, I will drop a video for that. So I know you are looking for some new magic modules. So I will make sure all the magic modules are new and unique. And make sure you watch this video till end if you want to find out which custom room I'm using in this phone. So let's get started. So the first and very useful module is called EOSP Mods. Now this is really popular because some people like to use Pixel Experience as their default ROM. And after using that ROM for a while, they start missing some features and customization because Pixel Experience is just plain stock Android. But with this small module called EOSP Mods in Magisk, you can have all those features and customization which you might miss in your stock ROM or Pixel Experience ROM. You will get plenty of customization like status bar, lock screen. You can basically customize anything in your phone and still be with your favorite room. So because of this module, at least you won't have to change the room because you missed some kind of feature. Not to forget this module also has inbuilt OT updates. So you don't need to download any extra zip file in case you want to update this module in the future. So apart from normal features in the miscellaneous, you get some extra features. For example, you can disable the screenshot sound. I really like that feature because I want my screenshot to be silent always. So basically this module works as a flavor on your stock Android. The next module is QS Spanel. So before Android 11, the quick setting was really good in Android. But ever since Android 11, they completely destroyed with this new tile system. I have been trying to find a solution for that. And this little module will fix your quick setting forever, especially when your phone is horizontal mode. You don't want to see your tiles all over. With this module, your tiles will be on one side and on the other side, you can have some space for your notification and other stuff. So the next module is Disable Flag Secure. You know, some apps don't let you take screenshot, especially banking apps, some of the streaming apps. With this little module, you can take screenshot in any app you want. It will remove the restriction of the screenshots set by a particular app. Because it's really frustrating if you can't take screenshot and you have to take a photo from another phone. And how can we make a magic list without the audio module? Yes, you guessed it right, it's Dolby Atmos. The latest version has some new improvements. You can tweak your audio the way you want, especially if you're a music lover or you listen to music daily basis using your headphone or your phone, this is a must have module for all. So with the new update, you get lots of new sound mode and of course, all of them are accurate. Especially the movie sound mode actually makes a difference when you're watching a movie on your phone. And by far, you must have noticed that the fonts on my phone actually looks good than the stock Android. Of course, it's a Google Sans little module. You can install that and replace your system-wide font with Google Sans. Looks beautiful, amazing to read. And if you're using a custom ROM and not using a custom font, it just doesn't make sense. So the next module is called Iconify. So if I'm allowed to have only one module in my phone, I will have Iconify installed because not only it can change your icons on your phone, but you can change the icons on your system as well. For example, you can change the icons of your setting menu, your status bar, and also on your quick settings. With this little module, you can customize your phone the way you want. You can also change the look of the switch in the system. You get this many design to choose from. I think it's really amazing that you can do that. And if you want to have some extra feature in Iconify, just install LS Sports Zip. In the Twix menu, you will see this Expose tab and here you will get more detailed features. And finally, you can make your device personal and unique. So that's it for today. Currently, I'm using this Calyx OS in Poco F1. Like this video if you want to see a review for that. And I will see you tomorrow.